Okay, I'm back for video four. That's like too many, but I'm cleaning today, so I gotta stay focused. All right, so I gotta put this shit away. That's what that means. So I'm gonna show you what I got. This is VHS. I'll probably go through these kind of quick because the other videos I'm rambling. I don't know why. I guess because it's early and I haven't, you know, focused. All right, so I love the paper cover on VHS. Clamshell irks me because they're thick and they break and they're just ugh. All right, so I got the Three Lives of Thomasina. This is like the cute little cat Walt Disney movie. I got Winnie the Pooh and A Day for Eeyore. This was free at my library. Like they didn't. I gotta re-glue that, but yeah, they when they get VHS, they actually give them out free because nobody wants them. That's literally what they said. It was kind of funny. Um, I got Scooby Doo meets the Boo Brothers. I got Clueless. I don't know why I got this VHS, but maybe be just because it's 90s nostalgia. I already own it on DVD and so on, but it is kind of fun to keep this because it's very 90s, very 90s film. I'll probably keep that. Um, I got this is another freebie from the library, Raggedy Ann and Friends. I've never seen this. It's pretty cool. I might, I don't know, I might trade it. Maybe I'll watch it and then maybe trade it. I don't know. Or I might keep it because it's Raggedy Ann. That is kind of cool now that I think about it. Um, Independence Day lenticular cover. I wish I could like, I don't think I can show you. Yeah, I don't, you know what, this is kind of annoying. It's not, maybe I need to take the cover off. Oh God, I don't know if I should do the, the plastic. Yeah, I don't know, it's annoying me though. Lenticular is supposed to usually like change and this doesn't, I don't know, I'm a little, wait, does it? Oh yeah, it does, okay. Then it goes to flames, all right. That was weird. But anyway, I thought this was cool that it's still in its plastic. That's a fun, you know. I meant to post this on July 4th and I didn't. Oh well. I got Mr. Hobbs Takes a Vacation. I'm a huge James Stewart fan. Phenomenal actor. And he was an interesting person. I got another freebie from Christmas. I mean, <laughs> from library. The Charlie Brown Christmas. This is super cute, but I'll probably trade it. I don't know though. Maybe not. I love Christmas films. This is weird. It says it on both sides. Same thing, but different picture. All right, I might keep it just because it's like that. All right, next I got The Adventures of Rocky and Bullwinkle. This I'll probably trade. This show was cute, but it's... I wasn't a huge fan of it. I don't know. Art's cool, but not that cool to me. This was a freebie from the library. Um, Actually, this is not... This is my best friend's Bambi. It's a brand new factory sealed. And she thought it was a, blue, a DVD and it's not. It's a fucking, it's a VHS. So I don't know if I'll keep it or if I'll sell it for her. I'm not sure. But yeah, that's cool. Um, all right, now we're going into more of like the more interesting ones. I got the Plague Zombies. Plague of Zombies. This is a Hammer Collection VHS. It's a really nice case. I'm... I don't know if the guy, actually, you know what? No, it really came like this. It has its stuff in it. Wow. This guy took really good care of his stuff. Anyway, it's a cool VHS. Um, I got the, did I already show this one? The Phantom. Again, another lenticular cover. I'm a sucker for these covers. They're so fun, dude. And this is, um, I can't think of his fucking name. What's his? He's super gullican. Oh my god, why can't I think of the guy who plays him? Oh my god, that's making me... Billy Zane. I feel like that was like a sin on my part for not remembering his name. But yeah. He's super gullican. Anyway. Um, I got Escape from New York. This is a beautiful cover. It's very like old school rental. This box. I'm guessing the guy switched it. Oh yeah, he did. He made it. You can see where he carefully put it together. Wow, that's really nice. I'll probably keep this. But yeah, really nice. Fun movie. Classic movie. 
Uh, Dawn of the Dead. This is the HBO Canon video. Wow, this is so heavy. Jesus. I need to watch this. Something seems funny with this. It's like extremely heavy. I think this is spool swapped. I don't know. Oh my God, sorry. I just never opened it. I gotta check that. I don't know. It's in like too perfect of condition. Seems a little funny to me. I don't know. Oh, that's irking me. I gotta check. All right, whatever. Interesting. Beautiful cover, but it does feel... Maybe he had to put it on a new VHS, because I've had to do that, where you like read... Yeah, you basically spool swap the tapes. Um, I got the Curve Fun movie. Very 90s, or early 2000s. I got the Frightening, New Classic Horror. This one's actually pretty good. It's very, like, homoerotica. But it's still a horror movie. Like, it's fun. And I got the Final Stab. I wish this damn sticker wasn't over the guy's face, but I want the sticker on there. But you can't really pick and choose, not can you? Final stab, that's a cool, cool slasher. I got Day of the Dead, Collector's Edition. Some of these I'm already trading. I know they're okay and yada yada. Um, this is the Day of the Dead. This is a really beautiful collection. I just don't have space. Like, I just can't keep all these movies that I know I'm not going to watch. Even though they're really cool, I just... I don't know, I can't keep the space. This is an Anchor, Anchor Bay Edition. The Night Strangler Collector's Edition. I'm digging that gold case. I got Schwarzenegger, The Terminator. This is a cool case. Oh yeah, it's a little bit. Um, this is cool. I'll probably trade it though. Um, Night of the Living Dead. I am. I'm keeping this because I love it. It's a 1990 theatrical version, dude. This cover is like so fun, right? Like keeping that. All right, I got Evil Dead 2. I swear to God, I find this copy copies of Evil Dead 2 like a million fucking times. I always find this one. Never any of the others. Only the sequel. I've already traded it like a few times with people. It's pretty funny. But what can you do? I guess it's just one of those that they made a lot. And they just, you know, there's a lot of copies available. Um, I got Phantasm 1, Phantasm 2. These are really beautiful VHS as well. I love the white and black, but I already own the movies, so I might just trade them. Even though they're like, you know, collector's pieces. And last but not least for the Blu-ray, DVDs. No, fucking VHS, what am I talking about? I need more coffee, you guys, like, for real. All right, these are really cool. These are my favorite of the finds. So I got, actually I take that back. These weren't found. These were, I bought these. Like I found somebody and bought them from. So this is Halloween 3, but it's the Japanese version. Really beautiful. Like, this does not do it justice. It's, look at the cover, like the case and stuff. Like it's, oh my God, look at this dude as I drop it and break it. So yeah, all in Japanese, like how perfect. It's so beautiful. And everyone knows, I love Halloween 3. That's, I love Michael Myers, don't get me wrong, but Halloween 3 is probably my favorite. If you count it of the Halloween series. Um, Cause technically it is, you know, that's what they wanted. But yeah, this, very cool find. I hope to find the Italian version next. So that would be ideal. I want like all the copies. All versions of that. And I got Jawbreaker. Now this is a German a German version. Look at this cover. This cover is so much nicer. Shit. Oh here. I'll show you the American version if you're not familiar. So this is the DVD of it. The VHS is actually really hard to find. But this is the DVD. See how colorful and 90s, fun, you know, very Rose McGowan. Very that movie. But this is like more of a tragic, like sick, 
I know what this scene's from in the movie too. And it, I mean, this movie is a sick car comedy. Like it's about girls that murder their best friend by killing her with a jawbreaker. So it is a darker film, you know? Ugh, this cover though, I'll ne probably never be able to watch it because I don't have one of those VHS players. But look, look inside. It's fucking blue, like bright blue. It's got these really cool stickers. It's just incredible how they did this. It's all in German. Look at that, it even has like a special originality quality seal right there. And it's been broken, obviously. It's just, ah, my pride and joy. But yeah, okay, that's all I got for VHS. So that was a good amount, right? Like I feel like, yeah, cause it's over 10 minutes, so. All right, if you've dealt with me this long, you'll probably, I might wait to make the book video. This is enough already, but maybe. And whatever, I'll see you guys later.